back here with another video of the Parkland chargers here in uh, this one is located in Delta it is the first 400 kilowatt you can see right there 400 kilowatt charger in Western Canada so Parkland's doing a major job deploying all these chargers this location has three cabinets which supports six cars charging at the same time these ones are different from the free wire ones that they had previously. These do not have batteries in them, so they just charge at the full rate the entire time, which is really nice to see because those other ones got hit pretty bad, uh, especially when they were free. So anyway, this one here, again, is a 400 kilowatt charger. The other two are 180 kilowatt chargers, more than you need for charging your car. Uh, one thing I can just say, about two years ago, I hit every Parkland Chevron on the run EV charger here in the lower mainland in one day. I did it on a Saturday, first thing in the morning. I went to North Vancouver and ended my day out in Chilliwack. I can't remember, I think it was 17 chargers or something, or 17 locations. There's no way I could do it now. There are so many of them out here. There's no other uh, company other than Tesla that's deploying chargers like these guys are and and again parkland they're just adding like crazy here so i just want to commend them uh for that because not only was i able to do that but the year after that i drove from vancouver over to uh, calgary on highway one using the parkland chargers and i came back on highway five which is the lower highway there was a few along the way but mostly they were just in the process of building them so that highway now is complete. So you can now drive all the way up to Prince George and I'll put a map of the chargers here in British Columbia. It's just amazing what they've done. And I'm really happy what they're doing. It's there's, again, nobody's doing it like these guys. And this charger, it's pretty cool. Um, again, like I say, this one is a 400 kilowatt charger and the interface is different. The application has changed since I last used these. And if you are driving an EV, not just a Tesla, um, this charger right here, it's going to help those that have the 900 volt battery pack. So again, check it out. Uh, let's go, I'll show you the interface here. Okay, so I'm using a A to Z charger right here, adapter. So it takes it from the CCS to a Tesla plug. I've always been using the A to Z. They've created this uh, really good charger tesla has their own there's a whole bunch of knockoffs out there but this one i've always used that a to z now you can see here it looks a whole lot different from the, what it was before I can show you i'm getting 45 46 here kind of gives a little bit of a uh graph of what the the uh, battery is um, we can go charge details and see what that is so it says charging in progress, charging duration, the current speed, how many kilowatts I've put into, into it, and then the flat rate. It looks like I'm being charged. Uh, right now it's free, so that's a good thing. And uh, that's pretty good. So let's take a look at the rest of these. So again, they do have a payment via credit card is coming soon. So that's something new. They didn't have this before. So you always had to use an app. And now if they have the credit card, you can just tap and pay, which is will make it a whole lot easier. So let's take a look at these ones over here. So a little bit smaller. Max 180. CCS. Again, these ones, I think they're ABB. Yeah, there we go. So it's an ABB uh, charger. And then here's the other one again, another 180. It's like they got a screen here, touch screen. I don't see a tap function available, which is uh, unfortunate. They do have garbage and wiper uh, windshield cleaners, which is really nice. They've got a lot of those. They're really doing a great job. So let's take a look at this cabinet because this is a new one. There we go on the run. Yeah. 
Huh. Surprised I don't see anything here that tells us what it is. So it doesn't show you what it is. But anyway, that's pretty good, 400 kilowatt. Okay, so just a little tour of the site. But I like these spots are really nice and wide. They're doing a really good job here. Um, there's the power cabinet down there. There's the grocery store. It does have a triple O, which is nice. You can get your milkshake or something if you want.